I'm sure that many of you are thinking very seriously about what you want to write about um, and how to write about that topic. So uh, just to let you know broadly how we use the essays, this is a place for you to speak to the admissions officers directly. It's one of the very few places in the application where you get to do that. And so the most, no, most important thing when it comes to writing the essays uh, is to make sure that you write it in your own voice. Uh, it doesn't actually matter that much what you choose to write about, you know, what topic you pick. We end up each evaluating about uh, 3,000 essays every year, so really after a certain point there's no such thing as a unique essay topic. I really say just pick something that you care about and then write it in your own voice. Uh, make sure that you have it uh, edited by a close friend or family member um, and ask them if it actually sounds like you. Again, this is one of the very few places in the application where you get to speak to your admissions officer directly and, and give them a sense of who you are and, and what your personality is like. Uh, so with that being said, let me turn it over to the students to just talk a little bit about their own uh, experiences with writing the college admissions essay. Yes, yeah, so I think um, with the essay, the way I kind of approached it was trying to figure out like what side of me hadn't been seen by the admissions office, um, and like it was a chance for me like to be kind of personal and honest, and like there's kind of like this like this pressure of like oh how do I like make something sound like me, like what do I even sound like? Um, and I feel like just like my approach to that was just like thinking like, all right, how can, if, I, if this essay was like a conversation with an admissions officer, how can like they get to know me uh, through my writing? Um, and like it was, it was not like a chance, it's not meant for you to like show off or brag or like hair flip. That's like for the, <laughs> that's like you do that with like your transcript and everything. This is like a time for us to be like, yo, like who are you? Um, how do you write? And like how, um, would you interact with this place, like, not through numbers, not through grades or anything like that. It's just, like, an open kind of forum for you to kind of explore um, how someone can get to know you through writing. So the way I approached my essay writing was I really, I, I took it as a chance to kind of reflect on the past couple years or even uh, before then, um, to kind of think about who I am and what made me the person I am today. Um, and also I thought about the aspirations I wanted to have what I wanted to do in the future, and all of that kind of helped me shape my essay. Um, so I started early, um, thinking that you know, like college application is a very stressful time, uh, especially because when you're a senior, not only do you have classwork, you have all these applications, other things to juggle. Um, so I tried to start over the summer um, and brainstormed, um, but the key was just having thoughts down for me. I think that really helped me write essays. Um, because I typically I am really scared of writing papers and stuff. So when I eventually got something down on the paper, I could work over the drafts and just keep editing uh, to get to something that I was proud of. Yeah, I think for me, like at some point when I started applying to colleges, I thought I read I had to find something really interesting about myself that I probably didn't notice beforehand. So I was like spending the summer worrying, like, oh, should I like go on a marathon? Should I do something that has some kind of deep meaning to it to an admissions officer? And then it was only to a certain point when I like talked to a guidance counselor, talked to my family a bit more, and just understood like the parts of my life that meant so much to me and the things that I like to talk about in regular conversation. Um, and I thought that was what I could best put on paper and explain to an admissions officer about why I should go to Yale, why I should go to any college. Um, I think like the personal is so deeply important in the admissions process, but it's also just the context that you come from and how the context has affected you overall. Because I think if my admissions officer didn't know where I came from, then she may have not understood like who I was. And if she didn't know who I was, then she wouldn't really care about where I came from. So it's kind of like a multi-layer thing. And um, since I had also applied through QuestBridge, I was able to put multiple essays in, I had a second one. And through my second essay, I got to talk more about the environment I'm from, while the one I used for Yale was more about me and so I think if you have the opportunity and if you're applying through QuestBridge or something like that you should take that chance and go ahead and add more information about yourself. So I think you'll hear that a common thread here is uh, all three of our students here put a lot of thought and time into their essays um, and they weren't trying to necessarily impress the admissions officer as their primary goal they were trying to get themselves across uh, and you know the admissions officer being impressed that kind of happens after the fact um, when you've told your story and uh, put a lot of thought into this essay.